and welcome back to Live Love Spa TV. I'm Kayla. Be sure to connect with me and your spa peeps on the Live Love Spa community app. For today's news, we are talking absolutely terrible advice that 12 million TikTok viewers are following, baby spas, and more. So let's get moving. Hoteldesigns.net predicts that the hotel spas above just hotels or just spas will be the highest in demand in a couple months. Hotel spas are most equipped to offer the full escape that includes city experiences, a getaway, and pampering, not to mention those outdoor experiences. Rancho Valencia Resort and Spa in San Diego, which just underwent a massively beautiful renovation, by the way, has drawn in clients with their private sun gardens, yoga pavilions, palm tree lined pool, and other gorgeous outdoor relaxation areas, in addition to their spa service. Services. That being said, those who don't have a spa could get creative to compete. So, you, I mean, you can't scroll Instagram for too long without seeing a friend hiking or on a boat. And the Kimpton Vero Beach in Florida is offering a complimentary stargazing on the sea experience with a local astronomer when you stay at the hotel, which is such a fun date idea and a way to make wellness excursions just part of your guest's experience. Next up, Packaging has been under siege over the last year, with sustainability becoming more of a necessity than a choice for brands. Instead of doing what everyone else is doing and creating refillable units, Kindred Black's Slow Beauty has put an artful spin on their packaging. Their skincare line comes in hand-blown glass vessels designed by master artisans around the US. And they sometimes switch which product comes in which bottle because many of their clients are now bottle collectors. I started doing this with the Lotion Yonka release designed by a different artist each year. And after I'm done, I just put some flowers in there. Real cute. And you can check out the latest edition of the Yonka Lotion on shoplovelovespa.com for yourself. And honestly, when is the last time that you loved a skincare package so much that you wanted to collect all of its versions? It's a cool idea. And I'm not done with this packaging chat yet. You've seen um, or uh, like these QR codes all over menus. and. It's not a new concept, but they have gained a huge surge in popularity over the last year, particularly in product sales. Stay with me here. According to Beauty Independent and ThingTesting.com, the founder of the Pimple Patch and Hero Cosmetics was on the Today Show, and they flashed their QR code to their Amazon product listing, and their sales that day jumped up 70%. So brands are now using QR codes on their boxes to tell brand stories. For example, um, sustainable apparel brand Pangea has QR codes that talk about each product's production impact. Uh, Coco Kind's QR code similarly tells about their sustainability efforts. And the seltzer brand Recess has a code that takes users to a meditative cloud popping game. So QR codes are being used on brand packaging to link to videos about their testing processes and provide transparency too, all giving the client a more complete understanding of the product and maybe a reason to fall in love with the brand. So tell me, have you used QR codes around your spa or property, your retail store, or on your social media? And what kind of secrets do your QR codes tell? Ooh, ah. This next story was on Good Morning America. I feel like every week there's some really weird or wacky idea that's trending on TikTok, but this one happens to have 12 million views and is potentially dangerous. Eli Withrow suggests a sunscreen contouring hack where you apply 30 SPF all over and then SPF 90 on the places that you'd normally put highlighter for a natural contoured look. Of course, then people do that and then they go bake out in the sun. So dermatologists like New York City based Dr. Michelle Henry told Good Morning America that this could lead to burns, future skin cancer and accelerated aging in those exposed area. And I'm sure you spot people out there are like, WTF, why is this happening? And that's where you come in. Please inform your people to apply a lightweight sunscreen frequently and all over because the sun doesn't deliver contour, it delivers carcinogens. Okay, thanks. Moving right along here, I've talked on the show about this idea of family spa. It's a cultural shift that required the spa industry to embrace the concept of wellness as a whole family instead of like a way to escape your kids. And I like that both options exist because while I am sure they're great, 
They're amazing. I don't personally want to hang out with your kids in the relaxation lounge. No offense. But this next idea is pretty darn cute. It's called My Baby Spa from the UK, and there are bookable sessions for parents and babies to relax and bond. Services include tiny baby jacuzzi baths, baby bonding massage sessions complete with coconut creams for their tiny little sensitive skin, little tiny baby mani petties, and of course, a photo shoot of your baby fully wrapped in Egyptian cotton in a spa basket. I love this because it could be a monthly event at your spa with bookable sessions for those who are, you know, hesitant to fully convert to a family friendly space, but who maybe still want to capture clients who want that experience. It's my favorite part, discovery. I love trying new products. It is a significant part of my life. And I'm here every week to give you the skinny. So let's talk Live Love Spa Wholesale, where you can save time, you can save money with this revolutionary new way to order popular brands with no minimums and one flat shipping rate. Like, can I get a round of applause? One flat shipping rate? Heck yes. Okay, so all the brands I talk about on the show are available for you and your clients to try through this wholesale platform. So go on there, click around. First up today, Catherine Weitzman Jewelry. Absolutely stunning eye catchers in a retail shop for sure. These pieces are carefully constructed with high quality recycled metals and cast from real elements found in Catherine's own beachy backyard. So there's leaves, branches, flowers, coral. Um, she's a classically trained uh, metalsmith and designs every piece by hand in her studio in Honolulu, Hawaii. So you know that each is super unique. Next up, we have Von Blicity. First off, the packaging is so cute and looks like little candies. I've been told that these are a really popular add-on to Manny or Petty treatments as an exfoliator plus hydrator in one. Bondlicity's bath and body treats are made with natural butters, fine salt, sugar, and richly scented oils. They really do smell fantastic. So happy self-care, everyone, and may your retail sales soar to the highest heights. And that's a wrap on today, everyone. Our Denver event is happening now, and the team keeps sending me pics of how much fun they're having. I'm super, super FOMO. So if you haven't signed up for an in-person, safe, silly, fabulous Live Love Spa event near you, I honestly have no idea what you're waiting for. Like here I am personally inviting you. Are you gonna just ignore me like that? <laughs> Sign up soon, cause space is limited. And until next week, my friends, live well, love always, and spa often. Bye.